guys welcome back to my channel i fully intended on bringing my vlog camera today but since i don't have my vlog camera we're doing it all on the phone so today is friday april 5th and i am on my way to get my hair done i'm actually getting ready to pull into the salon now um i haven't had my hair cut in over two years almost um since i've had my hair cut and so i am pulling in here now to get my hair cut and uh, yeah, we're gonna cut about six inches off and get some little curtain bangs. So I'm excited for that. Um, good old West Side Barbara in um, Harrisonburg. It's a cute, cute little shop. I love it so much. But uh, yeah, and then I'm going to go get my nails done. But I'll talk to you guys after because my hair appointment is right now. So I'll see you guys in a little bit. That's how this is gonna go. I mean, straight up told him, you're not gonna come here and put your hands on that kid. I'm making a video. Say hi. Say hi. <laughs> <laughs> no, I Not a future moment. It's called vlogging for a reason. Vlogging is not for cops. Oh, oh, oh. There you go. 
She on, she on, she on, all that. I cut it out. Alright, who's next? Glad to get them saved and then get out of here. But let's That's get right. them saved. That's right. We were just talking. I'm ready to go whenever myself, but there's a lot of other people not ready yet. That's right. But there will be a day when that trumpet sounds. And then there will be the greatest revival that ever hit the planet. That's right. Everybody that knows then that we are right. And they go, oh no. <laughs> and they can get saved at that point. I won't go into all of that now, but they can. But but you see, with that, and let me just throw this out. A lot of people, too many people living in fear. That's mm -hmm. right. The Bible says that men's hearts will fail them because of the fear that's coming on the earth. You shouldn't be one of them. That's right. We shouldn't be in fear. The Lord is my light and my salvation. Whom shall I fear? That's right. But said, so, well, you know, I don't want to have kids in this world. Why not? It's probably one of the best times to have kids. <laughs> right? <laughs> said, what in the world do you mean? If you raise your kids with any type of work ethic, That's they right. will be successful. That's, That's right. right. That's right. <laughs> they will rise to the top. Except you can go home. Because this world just don't have it right now. They will be in management. They will be running things. If they have any type of discipline and, and work ethic. Can you say amen? Amen. Your children should be extremely prosperous. In that. You know, coming into the world now. And on the flip side, let's look at it another way. See, Liz and I, we only have two. And that's because of me. <laughs> she wanted more. When we got married, we agreed <sighs> two, option on three, and I vetoed the option. <laughs> <laughs> but now, I'll be honest with you, that's one of my biggest regrets. Right now, I, you know, honestly, I wish we'd have had four. At least, but four probably enough. That's what I said. <laughs> 
you know, I don't like being outnumbered. That's one reason we stay for two. But at that point, let me just put it this way. And, and love me. Facebook, love me. <laughs> if only the crazy people are having kids. I'm good. <laughs> then we're doing the world to more problems. That's right. That's right. I mean, it's not rocket science. <laughs> you know, we were, when we started Act Sports Volleyball, we went and met with a number of coaches. God set you on assignment for you.